so guys after i had um come back from the market so i had to buy some paper you can see me some paper in the um palette because they were not so smooth so i wanted them to be extra smooth so that's why i took the paint to um you know some paper it i bought a yard of this um some paper for about um say 400 naira i think so 400 so i took my time guys it was not even easy it's not an easy process at all i took my time to some paper the palettes one by one and i had about six palettes four for the um bed frame and uh, two for the headboard so i took my time i started about 8 a.m in the morning and finished uh, at about like um, 1 1 p.m to 2 or something like that so it took time to be very honest it took time but i was glad that i was able to do it because this is what i've always wanted i didn't want the regular bed frame if not i would have gotten that like those that would have been the first thing that i would have gotten so i wanted to be sure of the kind of mattress i was getting to be able to know how many pallets i would buy because if my mattress was a was not as high as it is because my mattress is about 4.5 by 6 mattress but the length the height is about 14 inches if not more so it's quite high so there was no need to do two layers of this bed um frame so i wanted to be sure of the type sorry of the size of my mattress done this since so after taking my time to scrub i say scrub <laughs> after taking my my time to sand this whole um what's it called this whole uh, palette so it, the next thing was for me to um polish it so i got um wood finish that's what it's called wood finish in transparent i could have used other color it would have darkened it but i think i still appreciated the way this it was so i just used wood finish to polish the wood so to speak as you can see you can see the way it's making it look really nice compared to the one on the right so this is what i did i took my time i don't think brush would have been good because when i googled it on youtube here a lot of people did not use brush they were using clothes so that's what i used i would have worn a glove please try and wear a glove if you want to do it because it took time before this thing could actually leave my hand even if i washed it and washed and washed so yeah guys this took me approximately about 20 to 30 minutes to do the real work was actually sanding the pallets so this one was just like finishing touch and all so i bought about two bottles for about 1200 so yeah so that's what i got so this is it. See the difference between this one that i have polished and this one that i haven't polished the difference is clear to be very honest and i thank god that i thought of it because after just some papering the palette it will look washed so you need something to just polish it let it look really nice and bright you get so this is the way all colors sorry all palettes were looking and i'm so 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 proud of myself like i can't even believe that i was able to do this I woke up that morning because if you if you watch the video very well you see that i'm still with my hair net i just woke up i'm like i need to do this thing today and be done with it because i've been storing it now i bought it and i've been storing it that's been quite 
uh, a struggle to store six pallets without setting them up so i just needed to be done and set them up so yeah i was done and i left it to dry so now i'm about to um uh i'm about to fix them or place them so you can see what i'm talking about this is how big and high my bed is so i you see the reason why i think that there was no need to do two layers you see it anyway so i took my time to just sweep 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 where i'm going to put the um bed frames so after that i just went ahead to arrange it i wasn't sure how i wanted it to be so i was just um going with the flow so that's the headboard that i'm putting first then i went ahead to um put them like this because this room is not so big so i didn't want a situation situation whereby i would do this whole arrangement and there's no space in the room so when i had finished putting it like this i had finished putting it like this okay so i now put my bed i felt that it wasn't looking so nice i don't know for some reason i felt it was not looking nice maybe because of the pictures that i had there was there were spaces at the edge so i said okay let me try and like uh, maybe switch things up and change the setting of the bed the setting out that i now change it to would not have a headboard actually it will have a headboard but it will have spaces at the edge at the um edges but you see i go sha so i had to remove the, this thing was not even easy to do i had to remove my bed and my mattress and repeat reset everything again so i decided to do it like this to see whether i would have liked it like this without having a headboard everything would just be on the floor you get without having a headboard or anything but even before i had even finished I was already seeing that I didn't even like this one. Although it gave me that extra space like this at the edge. But almost it was already taking a better part of my room. And I still had idea of what to use those extra spaces to do. So um, I changed it back sharply. And to be very honest, I needed a headboard. I didn't just want the um, palace to just sit on the floor like that. So I just put this because this one has always been under my mattress on the floor. So I just said, let me just continue and just use it. So this is how the bed turned out to be the pallet bed. You can see what I'm saying. There was no need to have two layers because it would have been too high. Anyways, I also bought this um uh rough rattan um is it rattan or woven or I don't know the English. I'll put don't know the exact name i'm going to put it on the screen and i also got um this pampas grass i got them for about 1800 i'll be 1500 or so per bunch so i got about three bunches um then for the woven basket i got it for about um, 3500 or thereabouts so yeah guys i also got one other um storage basket i'll show you guys in subsequent videos so this is me just um removing a like a losing it up like opening the whole pampas grass and everything so yeah got 
comes out well. So I'm going to be hanging it over there. So. Mm -hmm.